On this episode of DPV, we're checking out this large view auto darkening helmet from Eastwood with True Color technology. How's it going, guys? I'm Josh, and uh, today we're checking out an auto darkening helmet from Eastwood. So, this made it on my Christmas list and then made it under the tree. So I'm pretty excited about this. I've been using this old helmet that my dad got me way back when I think I was in like junior high or something. So I've had that sucker for 20 years or more. Um, and uh, yeah, doing the whole flip thing to uh, weld, just not that fun. So we're gonna try this sucker out. Uh, I'll tell you what I think and uh, yeah, let's get started. Nice and shiny, not like my other one. Peel this guy off. I don't know if you've used like the Harbor Freight ones. They have this little skinny window, so I definitely wanted the large view because that's one thing I liked about my old, you know, flip down helmet is it had a big viewing area. So this one's got the big view. Knobs feel good. To adjust it here, you just push down and turn one way or the other. So that's nice. See how comfortable it is. Oh man, look at that air. Yeah, I can still see you right now, which is pretty cool. Uh, looks like I still got a sticker on the inside, so better take care of that. So I don't know if you can see in there, but we've got Different power levels for as far as the shade, which is nice because sometimes I'm just doing wire feed and uh, sometimes I'm running a stick and the stick you need a little bit more uh, darkening. So got multi shades. You can set the delay, how long it takes to uh, activate the darkening. And there's actually a dial for, um, so you can select the shade range over here, but then you can fine tune it infinitely over here which is pretty dang sweet. So, um, anyway, not sure if it's got a battery in it or not. We'll have to check that out. Comes with a few more uh, lenses, so that's cool. All right, it's got batteries in it, and they are ready to go. There's no film or anything, but low battery light's not on, so we're gonna go ahead and give it a test here. All right, got my little uh, Weld Pro MIG 155, um, and, uh, working on some exhaust here so this is one of those situations where having an auto darkening helmet is super helpful because see I can just hold that make sure I'm all lined up and still be able to see what the heck I'm doing and not have to flip the lid down so um, let's give this a go here Alright, so I think uh, I'm going to try to set up the GoPro inside the helmet. I'll just use my other one for a second to uh, show you guys just how cool that color is. It is amazing just how well you can see and uh, yeah, it's rad. Man, I am real happy with that. That uh, works really, really good. Uh, it's nice and responsive, and uh, what you can see in that thing, it's gonna be a game changer for my welding, especially for, you know, like when we're working under things and gotta get everything all in just the right position. It's hard to get your helmet foot down, so this is gonna be great. So, anyway, I believe you can pick this thing up on Amazon. Eastwood does have an Amazon store, so I'll link that down in the description below. This one, I think it was around 65 or 70 bucks. They also have one that uh, has a panoramic view, so there's uh, like windows on the side too, which could be helpful, I don't know. So anyway, very happy with it. We'll see how long it lasts. Um, I'm gonna get back to welding on this truck. 
Yeah, so anyway, that's the uh, Eastwood Large View Auto Darkening Helmet with the True Color technology. It's pretty rad. I'm excited. All right, wheel it, wreck it, wrench it, repeat. See you next time.